plenty of locals in the crowd as well. Well, there should be a, a confident South African team after the way they beat Zambia in their last game. Oh, referee tonight, Nia Grower Dickens from Kenya with uh, Mary Yoroji and Ronald Katenya. Great match it was too, 3-2 it finished. And we're off here then at the Mohamed Hamlaoui Stadium. Nigeria, all in white, one of the pre-tournament favourites. Kicking from right to left in the first half and immediately on the attack. Nice little turn there from Linus and he has a shot from distance and it was well struck but always going wide. Gennaro Johnson. His left foot here with the corner, plenty of men to aim at. Goes into the far post and it's off the post again and then it's in, it's the opener. And it's Vicky Makuana. South Africa take the lead here in just the sixth minute. Well, that is a goal that could put Nigeria out of the competition early days. Nice delivery from Amato. Unmarked, has to be said, was uh, Waylon Renneker for the initial header. Came back off the post. Mukawana in the right place at the right time. Drove it low. So nutmeg the goalkeeper on the way in as well. That's a bit unlucky. Well. Starting the game on the right-hand side. Oh, and the ball's come through here. Oh, it's just wide. My word, Abu Bakr Abdullami. Will feel he should have done better. Was put on a plate for him. Lovely interplay on the edge of the box. It's all been missed by everyone in midfield and. Uh, some dancing toes here, and they're through on goal here. Nigeria Johnson slips, and it's 1 1. What a start to the game this is! Well, has the offside flag gone up? I wonder. The offside flag did go up, didn't it? So they finally find the net through Agada, but the flag goes up. So Kakana, maybe Amato. Looks like Kakana has the strike. Really good save from Richard Odo. And the keeper's a bit slow coming off his line here, and that's nearly... Well, South Africans nearly shot themselves in the foot there. Gennaro Johnson should have come off his line, but didn't, and the ball is in the... Uh... Oh, whipped across goal. Didn't miss the post by much, actually. Nice for Eki. Still Eki. Shot across goal, well taken by the goalkeeper. Abdullahi was uh, lurking just in case there was a spill. Oh, Mabena does well to get his foot in. Very well indeed. Linus chips the ball back into the area, and there was some sta statuesque defending. Jose Manyama is watching the ball. Back on the attack, Eke. He's passed one, nice pass into the middle, goes for the one, two. And the shot, slight deflection off Wallace, but good save by Johnson. All very well, and you can see there in midfield, dropping very deep, lots of space for Hope Linus. Some lovely skills going on there from Eke. As Lawali comes in, and that's just wide of the upright. Lawali again on the overlap, the right back. Corner comes into the near post, keepers nowhere near it, and that's the equaliser. Charles Agada came into the starting lineup tonight. First start of the tournament for the number 11, and he's got the goal against Nigeria, back on level terms.
Second goal of the tournament, Nigeria. It's their 15th shot already of this first half, by the way. Well, Gennaro Johnson there, the keeper, came for the uh, initial corner, got nowhere near it at all. He was then completely out of position for the header from Agada. See what it means to him. And it sits up, thought about the shot, went for the pass instead, and that's a good save from Johnson, quickly off his line. This time it was Abu Bakr Abdullahi. Can't quite uh, make some magic this time. Mukawana, though, has got that ball out to Mabena. Now Mabena goes past one, goes past another. Mabena! And has that crossed the line? Has it crossed the line? Yes, it has. South Africa spectacularly back in front on the stroke of half time. And Sia Bonga Mabena has finally exploded into life in this tournament. Nine goals in qualifying. And that's his first of this tournament now. As soon as he got the ball here in space, it was really good play from Makuana in the build up. As soon as he got the ball in space, he could run at one. Such good balance. Ball clearly over the line. Such control when running at speed. Reminds me of a couple of well-known, fairly diminutive Argentinians running like that with the ball. And that will be back underway then here in Constantine. South Africa in their golden green hit kicking. Put South Africa ahead. Nagada with the drop post goal and it's 2 2 already. What a start to the second half. Nigeria taking just 30 seconds to get back on level terms once again. And it's Light Eke. So the changes to the lineup from coach and Duka Ugbade have certainly paid dividends here. The two players brought into the side tonight have scored the two goals. Charles Agada, good play over on the right hand side, teasing ball between the goalkeeper and the defence. And Eke stole in at the back post ahead of Jose Manyama. Bundle it in to make it 2 2. Well, what a game we're having here in Constantine. Moved out to a wider role, uh, sent more central role. Here he is picking up the ball just on the edge of the area, the number nine. Lee whipped into the area, and Mabena. The golden opportunity to make it 3 2. Uh, okay. Cross comes in, and that's 3 2. Abdullahi. Well, they moved the ball quickly, Nigeria. And for the first time in the game, they take the lead. And it's Abu Bakr Abdullahi. For this first goal of the tournament. Have a look here. He moved the ball swiftly. Okay, involved. Hint of offside, maybe. South African arms went up for an offside, nothing given. And Nigeria have hit the front. Retreating as fast as they can, long ball for Abdullahi. Got Chichero in front of him. Nice turn from Eke, still Eke, still Eke! Oh, off the up, wow. What a goal that would have been, it would have been an absolute winner as well for Nigeria. Depending on what happens tomorrow night in Group C, 
As Abdullahi has another shot, and there's Lawali! And a double save from Johnson. Four minutes of added time left for South Africa. I think, given the status, or the state rather, of the uh, groups, job number one, don't concede a fourth. Job number two, try and find an equaliser. Until the last seconds, and that is it, says the referee. Nigeria are through to the quarterfinals of the under-17 Africa Cup of Nations with a 3-2 victory here against South Africa.